Hello YouTube, my name is Michael and today I'm going to be unboxing the DeWalt 20 volt cordless jigsaw. I picked this up for an upcoming project and I thought I would do the unboxing and a bit of review with you here today. So let me get this opened up here. Now I will say this as well. Um, in terms of what we're looking at here, this is actually the jigsaw. It does not come with a battery. So that is something that you're gonna to wanna to keep in mind when looking at, looking at this product. Uh, now, the reason I picked up DeWalt, uh, it is a brand that I think has a great value. It's very durable. Uh, the first purchase of the DeWalt tool that I picked up was the 20 volt uh, drill here. And as it turns out, it came with two batteries. So that may be something that you'll want to also consider when looking at a jigsaw for yourself. Let's get to the unboxing here. Okay, so again, we're... So my first impressions of the tool is that it's very solid. Uh, it has a good weight to it. Um, of course, it's missing the battery at this point here. I will show that to you as we go through this uh, unboxing and review here. Uh, just a couple of things about it here. Now, I notice it has a trigger lock. So if we toggle this switch back and forth, uh, it releases the trigger, which I think is perhaps just a good safety feature, particularly when it comes to changing out the blades. Uh, I will mention as well that it is variable speed. Uh, it will run up to 3300 RPM. It has a one inch stroke capacity on this. So a couple of other things that I wanna sort of bring to your attention here. Uh, it has a blower function. So what we're looking at right here is a lever that allows you to increase the airflow. And if you take a look right here, there's a little nozzle here that's going to uh, blow uh, in front of the blade to reduce any of the dust that you may be picking up. Uh, a couple of other things about the tool. It has a removable shoe here, so it allows you to uh, take this off and, and put this back on uh, for protecting your materials when you're handling something that is uh, a little bit more fragile. Uh, it has a quick release blade mechanism here. So you'll notice here that there is a lever. When we pull on this lever right here, it will open up the locking mechanism and I'll show you how a blade is installed here. Now it also has a uh, a setting here that allows you to change how the blade, the cutting action of the blade. So in this particular position right now, uh, the blade is going to be running straight up and down. And as you move it forward up towards the number three, uh, it does uh, put a, a, an, an orbital sort of motion into it, which allows for a more aggressive cut. However, it will allow for more splintering. Now, other features about this, uh, this is a release mechanism right here. So this should be able to tilt to 45 both directions. And you'll notice here as well that there is some pre-marked, uh, what do we have here? We have uh, 0, 15, 30, and 45. So it will go both directions here. And then it will lock back in place. And then the lever will come here and hold it all together. So great overall first impression here. Uh, I'm going to put in one of the blades that it came with. So we have a, just two variations. I think that would be a metal blade and this one is for uh, wood. Now the type of blade that we have here in this particular case is what they refer to as a T-lock mechanism. So this particular blade is uh, from DeWalt, but you will see that there are other manufacturers as well who do a similar type of locking mechanism. So this will allow you to pick up other blades. Uh, I just happened to pick this up on sale and it gave me a good overall collection of blades that will run in this saw here. So let's try to put one of these blades in. So again, we, we have the releasing mechanism. So it opens it up. Uh, you'll notice there are uh, some guide wheels here and then underneath it will take the blade just up into this. So it sets right in, it releases, and that now has the blade firmly in place. And as I said to you before, I selected DeWalt uh, because I think it's a great quality of tool. Um, the, the first purchase of DeWalt I had picked up a, um, it allowed me to get two batteries with the, and the charger with the particular drill, which allows for interchangeable uh, function with the batteries here. So something that you may want to keep in mind when looking at, at your different choices out there. So it snaps into place here. And there is... So 
So I'm going to do a couple of cuts for you just to give you a bit of a sense of how it performs. Uh, I'm going to cut something out of a three quarter inch pine as well as out of a two by four and we'll show you how this saw performs. Overall, first impressions, very solid. Looks like it's gonna have some good power and it has some good features that I think will uh, serve me very well with the upcoming project. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, throw those in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks so much.